Hi all and welcome back to Amelia Finance. So I thought based off of going taking the PMP test, I thought there might be value to giving a little bit more background onto what is Agile or what are the different components of uh, the PMP and what it's looking for now. So I thought just let's start off with the basics. What is Agile? So Agile is a framework that's used for project, product, and portfolio management. Meaning, um, there's this great image out there called the Agile Umbrella. If you go search for that, I'll include a link in the description below. But it shows an umbrella, and it shows all the different types of Agiles that could sit under it. Scrum, Kanban, Lean, XP, lots of different things for different verticals or different, uh, just different types of businesses. So, like, example would be for manufacturing, perhaps you'll use Kanban for... Uh, software development, you might use Scrum, so just like different different things for different needs. The reason why, um, there's three different key reasons why you might use Agile methodologies, and those are fast feedback cycles, time to market, and team morale. So first things first, fast feedback cycle. The customer, stakeholders, your leadership team, um, they're able to quickly see what was creative, what was done, um, and provide feedback, real-time feedback very quickly after a short amount of time, perhaps like two weeks or so. They're able to see an MVP, a minimal viable product that they're able to provide feedback on. Number two, time to market. Because all of your key stakeholders are able to see what was being created and what's being delivered, they're able to give their feedback and then the team is able to quickly adapt and change a little bit or update the things that they have gaps on. And this is great because this improves productivity and quality of the product. And then um, one of the core tenets of the Agile Manifesto is working software over documentation. So you should be delivering software quickly and effectively. And then the fast feedback cycles allow you to really replicate and recreate that quickly. Number three, team morale. Another core tenet of the Agile Manifesto is individuals and interactions over process and tool. A teamwork that well, works well together, is excited to come to work, is excited to learn, um, works quicker, is able to deliver more rapidly, um, and just has a more fun time working in general. Now, I referenced the Agile Manifesto a couple times just now, so I thought it would be good to read it out and I'll also include a link to it. So the Agile Manifesto goes as this. We are uncovering better ways of developing software by doing it and helping others do it. Through this work, we have come to value individuals and interactions over process and tools, working software over comprehensive documentation, customer collaboration over contract negotiation, responding to change over following a plan. That is, while we value the items on the right, the things that we'd like to do, we put more value on the things on the left, the things that are complete. And so essentially what that's trying to say is we want to move quickly, we want to move uh, agilely, if we want to use that word, we want to be flexible to the change, rapidly changing needs of the work environment and be able to deliver something in a timely manner as well and have a team that loves doing the work. That is one of the, the core things that I think a lot of businesses are struggling with is work isn't always fun and not that work is fun, but you have to have an environment that people say, you know what, it may not be my favorite thing to ever to do is to go into work, but at least when I go in, I have a good time. I work with people that I'm excited to talk with and interact with. Um, and that's something I think, especially in today's market where you have all these, you have multiple employees thinking about or wanting to change jobs, I think agile methods help to keep employees connected and plugged into the work environment that they're in. So with that, thanks for watching Amelia Finance. Like, follow, ask questions, uh, and I'll keep doing a couple more series on agile and the different components that make up that. So thank you. Bye.